Volcanoes are unpredictable forces of nature, and there are about 1,500 geologically active ones around the world. Let that sink in. This one, Bardabunga in Iceland, spewed thousands of cubic feet of molten lava from a crack in the Earth's crust back in 2014. By volcanologist standards, that was considered a peaceful eruption. Peaceful. Bartabunga could erupt explosively again one day, shutting down air travel and unleashing a level of environmental destruction that would wipe out roads and homes and daily life as we know it. Active volcanoes like this one exist all over the world, but active is sort of a misnomer. An active volcano can erupt at any time, but it also could not. That's the nature of these bubbling cauldrons. They're incredibly dangerous and mystifying and so hard to predict. Scientists are working hard to figure out exactly when a volcano is going to erupt. The best we can do now is whittle a prediction down to a series of probabilities and best guesses. And to do this, volcanologists have a few things in their toolkit. Seismometers that can pinpoint the rise and fall of magma, thermal imaging to detect the heat around a volcano, and chemical sensors that sniff for volcanic gases like sulfur and CO2. Even with all of these data points, though, there's still no such thing as a volcano forecast. No one can say that this will erupt in so many days. As they work towards getting a forecast, scientists are adding another tool into their toolkit, seismic noise interferometry. It's like listening to the whispers of a volcano. Let's break that down, though. In a study, researchers analyzed seismic noise moving through the volcano Kilauea in Hawaii over a four-year period. Seismic noises are low-level vibrations in the Earth. They come from things like earthquakes or ocean waves. In this case, magma swirling inside a volcano. By using seismic noise interferometry, the researchers measured the speed of seismic activity moving through a volcano. They were able to record how fast the vibrations were traveling and then isolated the noise, or whispers, coming from inside. By isolating the seismic noise, scientists were able to identify the sounds that indicate an increase in internal pressure, which is a warning sign for a future eruption. Going one step further, the researchers compared those results to a second set of data, which measured the bulging and shrinking of a volcano's summit over time. Kilauea is a very active volcano. As the pressure in its magma chamber increases and decreases, it is constantly bulging and shrinking. This makes it a prime candidate for this kind of research. The researchers found a correlation between the speed of this volcano's seismic energy and the bulging and shrinking. As the magma fills up, it causes an increase in pressure, which produces much faster seismic waves, and volcanoes tend to bulge up and out before an eruption. So, by combining these two data sets, researchers were more able to accurately predict when an eruption could happen. Technical improvements like these are bringing volcanologists one step closer to understanding the inner workings of these explosive mountains and the behaviors that lead to a massive eruption. We've still got more work to do, but predicting chaos is getting that much more precise. Special thanks to our sponsor, Domain.com. When you buy a domain name from Domain.com, you're taking the first steps in creating an identity and vision for your brand. No domain extension will help you tell your story like a .com or .net domain name. Get 15% off Domain.com's already affordable domain names and web hosting when you use the coupon code SEEKER at checkout. Volcanoes spew lava at 1,000 degrees Celsius on Earth. But did you know there are volcanoes out in our universe that spew ice? Learn more about galactic ice volcanoes here. Have you ever visited a volcano, or do you want to? Let us know in the comments. Please subscribe for more SEEKER, and thanks for watching.